Hello everyone. So today we will discuss chapter number 11 of operating system course. Uh, this particular chapter is about file system interface. And specifically in this video, I'm going to talk about the first topic and that is the file concept. Like what is a file system? What are the different types of files? Uh, like the basic types of files and what sort of operation a file system typically support. So let's start with the first agenda item, the file concept. So what is a file? First of all, let's try to understand what is a file. So if you want to write something onto the hard drive, so let's assume that this is basically our hard drive. This is a simple hard drive on which we are running Windows operating system. This is the hard drive, another hard drive, which is running Mac operating system. And for example, Mac operating system or Linux operating system. Now the question is how this hard drive, this secondary storage will be organized. So this sec uh, organized mean like what sort of data can we can write on it? What si sort of data we can execute it, uh, how to access the data from this hard drive, how to write the data on it, how to read the data on it, all these information, like everything about the data organization, data de deletion, data termination, data access is basically controlled by a file system. Now, I'm 100% sure you might already heard about FAT, like file allocation table, uh, new technology file system, extensible file system, all these are the file system, which tells the operating system how the files or which type of files can be right, what would be the maximum size of the file which can be stored on the hard drive, uh, how to delete the file, how to execute a file, all these information are supported by these file system. Like in Windows, we use NTFS, like for example, in Linux, we use XFS, and for example, removable hard drives, we can uh, we can typically use FAT file allocation table. So, so I, I believe everybody got the basic concept about file system. Now the file which can be written onto the hard drive. Of course, we know that the file system tells how what sort of file can be written. Now, what is there exactly this file is? So, if you want to define the basic definition of file, file is basically a collection of collection of bits, bytes, or characters. Right, that is basically a file. Bit bytes are the collection, uh, the characters. That is called a file. Or simply, you can say the named collection, the named collection of bits, bytes, uh, or the related information which can be stored onto the secondary storage. That is called file. All right. Now, very importantly, if you want to write a data onto the hard, let's say if I give you like two bits and ask you, please store it on your hard drive. You cannot do that. If you want to store anything on your hard drive, it should be in the form of a file, which your file system understand. So uh, file files are basically a form of data, form of data that computer understands, form of data that computer understands, or you can say computer can store right form of data that computer can store and file is basically file must belong to a file system category file system category which your filing system file system can support the file system of your operating system so that is simply a file. So the bottom line is if you want to store anything on your hard drive, it must belong to a specific file type, right? And then depending upon your file system, your file system will tell what would be the maximum size of the file, how the files can files can be retrieved, accessed, deleted and all. Now, the next thing is this is the file system. So let's let's talk about the types of the files, like how many different types of the files are there. So typically there are three main types of the file. There are many different types of file. Typically there are three types of file, text files, source file, object file. Now what is a text file? This is the main or the basic type of file. So text files are basic type of file, files, uh, basic type of file, which are the sequence of sequence of letters or characters. So sequence of letters or characters are called text file. Now the question is, I mean, if you, what are the sequence of character? So this file, text file can be a plain text file, like for example, where you can create reports, doc file and all that. Those are plain text file. These can be, for example, your source file. Oh, let me see. 
All right, my pencil is stopped working. All right, so let me see what has happened with this. All right, 